I've got another XP and money farm for you guys to do. This is just a main story one that if you missed it, it's unfortunate. You'll meet on a new character. You can do it when you get through this part. So you're down in the sewers. This is like, I don't know, the 10th or 12th main story mission, something like that. And you'll get to this part where you learn how to do your fury attacks. And this is an area you can actually abuse in order to get crazy XP and cash while you're here, if you want to. So what you'll do is you'll open up the door and you skip this cutscene every time, if you can, if you can, I mean. And then it gets to this part where you're in like a permanent fury mode for this and there's tons of zombies. So what you'll do is just as soon as you come into this, you'll just start killing every single zombie as fast as you can. And then you're going to make sure that you don't kill all the zombies, because if you do, then it will um, progress your story. So you're just going to kill the majority of them, and once there's just one or two left, then you're going to stop. So after those ones, I would just be, you know, I'm like, good enough, whatever. Then you return to main menu, and then you can go back in. And every time you kill these zombies, you get XP. And every time you kill these zombies, you get money. Also, these zombies will drop materials you can pick up every time if you remember to do it. And sometimes they drop uh, rare quality weapons. So make sure you leave this area with a full inventory of blue weapons that you can then sell later as well. But yeah, so this one gives you about 400 XP every single cycle like this. And you can do the cycles in like 20 seconds or something. So, I mean, this XP is just crazy. So, uh, if you didn't do this, that's unfortunate. But it's also, you know, you can make a new character. You can just do it then. But yeah, so you just do that. And then you exit the main menu. And you just keep doing that over and over and over again. And you'll get crazy XP and tons of cash and tons of rare items and stuff like that. That then you can go on to sell. So, hopefully this helped you out. And if, again, if you already went through this, and I guess just next time you play, if you do play again, you make another character, then you'll be able to abuse this down in the sewers on the Red Mist main story mission in Dead Island 2.